Okay, how you doing? I just wanted to talk quickly about moving files around. I had a uh, colleague who recently got a Mac, and he had his files that he had to move over from his PC, and he didn't quite know where to where to put them. I wanted to talk a little bit about um, the programs or applications, as they're called on Macs, used to move around files. On a PC, it's called Windows Explorer, and on a Mac it's called the Finder. First we'll take a quick look at the PC. Right now I have a, um, I have a Windows Vista going and I just want to quickly show you how he showed me where the files were. Was He clicked on a program for example on uh, Microsoft Word right now and went to open and then clicked on that and then showed me where the files were. I, th I find that's uh, relatively common that people use um, the open dialog box inside of a program to to sort of navigate their um, files and see where stuff is. This right here is the is the equivalent of it's Windows Explorer. It's just tasked for a certain um, purpose, which is opening a particular file within a particular program. To get to your files generally, just if you're using Vista, just simply click on uh, the the um, window window button there and start typing windows and you'll see that windows explorer comes up now what I what I recommend doing generally is to right click on the windows explorer and then add to quick launch menu and then it'll show up down here in the taskbar I've already done that but to show you what it looks like it's very familiar looking it is it looks a lot like what um, the open dialog box looks like, but this is where you can move your files around. You can you, know, you can drag things around from here and uh, organize your files this way. I just wanted to let you know about it, um, about the program. It's very useful. Um, I'm in Windows and on a, on a Mac, but I'm going to switch right now to um, the. Mac and show you what it looks like there. So, so to get his stuff off of the external drive he had it attached to, it, all you did was plug it in. And once you plug in a drive to a Mac, the drive will mount on the desktop right in plain view, so you can you can deal with it very easily. On a PC, you'll notice typically your um, drives mount down the taskbar. They're sort of hidden um, down. It's called a tray in the lower right corner. They're kind of hidden. They're a little bit hard to get to. Now, to um, by default, these things will be available. If you wanted to hide them, you go to Preferences on the Finder window, and then unclick, uncheck um, hard disks, external drives, CDs, whatever you didn't want to see. You could simply uh, uncheck them and, and and hide them from view. I don't necessarily recommend that. They're handy to have. So all we would have to do is take, for example, if his um, his folder. We plugged in his folders here. All we had to do was click on it to open it up, and then click on the Finder to get another window open. Go to File, New Finder Window. The way I normally do this is by pressing Command N. Command N is a universal command for new window of whatever application you're working with. I use it for uh, Word. I use it for um, Firefox, Safari. Uh, those are handy, uh, handy things to do. So all we have to do is take his folder, and then press Command A to select all, or to select just some of the stuff. Just click on one, and then click on the last one you want. Shift click to click, grab everything in between. Or another keyboard shortcut is to pull down the Command button and select. The particular ones you want. So in this case, we'll just say Command All, Command A, and get them all, and then click, drag, drop. So we go from his. Oh, well, there's Windows. Get rid of that. We go from his uh, drive, which was mounted on the um, desktop, and we plugged it into the USB port. We grabbed the stuff we wanted to, and then we clicked. Um, and dragged it over into the, in, in this case we use the documents folder on his hard drive. And, and that's it, so that's, and that's how you move stuff around on the Mac. All you have to do is use the finder, it's right here, and that's where all your stuff will be, your applications, your
pictures and everything else. And these are definitely handy too. You should take a look at these sometime. There's these uh, smart folders right here. It searches for everything you did for, did in the last day, yesterday, all images, all movies. Those are smart folders. It's a different subject and they have all range of uses, but the ones that come loaded up are very, um, are very handy. So that's, uh, that's moving file, a little bit about moving files around and I um, hope it was helpful and thanks for